Are you a lover of all things McDonald's, Taco Bell, Burger King, and more? Well, then you might enjoy this video of fast food secrets you didn't know. Whether it's a burger, a large serving of fries, or just some donuts, fast food restaurants have become a staple in many people's lifestyles and diets. How much thought have you given your fast food eating experience? How much do you really know about your favorite burger place? Before we begin this video, make sure you subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss out on all of our awesome life hacks, tips, and tricks from your number one bestie. Number 13, color psychology. The first of many fast food secrets in this video has to do with the color fast food restaurants use in their food and advertisements. You might not know it, but colors play a big part in the decision-making process when it comes to food. The color scheme that is chosen is used in order to influence your decision-making. Take McDonald's, for example. The colors are red and yellow and are meant to entice you to buy food. Yellow and red complement each other perfectly. At a subconscious level, they make you want to stop for a bite to eat. This is sometimes called the ketchup and mustard theory Red is known to trigger appetite and hunger while drawing attention at the same time. Yellow triggers feelings of cheerfulness and friendliness. The two combined make a perfect match. Number 12, frozen meat. You might be surprised to find out that there's no such thing as grilled meat at fast food joints. Most beef burger patties at places like McDonald's and Burger King are actually frozen and processed at a factory nearby. They are then shipped to different locations. If this doesn't turn you off of fast food restaurants, I'm not sure what will. Number 11, artificial smells. Fast food chains tend to add an artificial smoke smell to their meat in order to make it seem more like real beef patties. And yes, those grill marks are either added on or are just there when the meat is reheated. This seems deceitful, but it's totally common for fast food joints to do this. Number 10, supersizing. The goal is to always sell you more. That's why the staff at places like Burger King or McDonald's is always taught to ask if you would like to upsize a drink or get some sort of dessert. Psychology has shown that it is much more difficult to say no to something that is offered. Number nine, breakfast foods. Lots of fast food places sell breakfast with eggs that look like they came pre-packaged, which is gross. Are they real eggs? It is actually a combination of real eggs and something called premium egg mixture. It consists of glycerin and food additive E552. Remember this the next time you order a breakfast sandwich. And besides, really, who gets breakfast at places like Taco Bell? Number eight, fast consumption. The yummy, greasy, and delicious food at fast food joints like Taco Bell and other places is made to be consumed quickly. This is because studies have shown that more chewing and slower eating leads to less total food intake. So the faster someone eats, the more they will eat which means more money for the restaurant. Studies have shown that when we eat at fast food restaurants, we actually chew our food about 12 times. When we eat outside of restaurants, in our home, at work, etc., we chew roughly 15 times. Who knew that there were studies out there that were based solely on counting how many times we chewed our food? Number seven, sizing. A medium-sized drink is not actually medium, since most people get the standard size drinks, the standard is no longer medium, it's actually large. Studies show that people are more likely to drink more when the drink is labeled as medium as opposed to large, which means they are more likely to buy a medium drink. Number six, burgers. Burgers are cooked almost immediately in fast food restaurants. As you have probably already noticed in your lifetime, burgers are created in about 30 seconds when you order your food at a fast food joint, hence the name fast food. There's a reason the quality of burgers at fast food joints is so much different than they are at regular restaurants. The reason burgers are made within such a short period of time at fast food restaurants is because the meat is already frozen and all they have to do is heat it up. 
Most of the time, standard burgers are already pre-made, and the chain's goal is to serve as many burgers as possible. So the next time you order a burger at McDonald's or Burger King, you may want to think again. Number five, soda. Some people insist that soft drinks at fast food restaurants just taste a little different and are better. Although it is the exact same recipe, most chains tend to mix the soda with water. Fast food chains also store their soda in metal containers that maintain the freshness. Some fast food restaurant sodas also taste different due to their filtration systems. Mixing the soda concentrate with water at the restaurant also makes the drink taste fresher. It may be the reason behind why people insist on sodas at fast food restaurants tasting better. Fast food restaurants are also known to have different water to syrup ratio, which makes the soda taste better. Number four, styrofoam cups. Did you know that styrofoam cups that store hot drinks can have some negative health effects? It's true. Hot drinks that are served in styrofoam cups can actually have a negative effect on the nervous system. And some studies have even shown that it could cause signs of depression. This is because styrofoam is not supposed to be heated. And when it gets hot or stores hot liquid, a chemical is released which can create adverse effects. Styrofoam cups contain styrene, which is classified as a possible human carcinogen by the National Toxology Program, NTP. Carcinogens are substances which are capable of causing cancer. Number three, neurologically speaking, everything tastes the same. Fast food chains know what tastes good and what doesn't. They understand which foods react to which reward centers of the brain. This makes it easier for fast food chains to create foods which are more likely to be consumed by people because of the way their brains react to the food they are eating. Number two, pleasure receptors in the brain. If you eat fast food often, you've probably noticed that most fast food restaurants have the same underlying taste or feel to it. Whether it's beef burgers, fries, ice cream, or even a drink, this is because all of these foods actually hit the same type of pleasure receptors in the brain. That's why when you eat a delicious Crunchwrap Supreme from Taco Bell, you feel like you're the happiest person alive. That is, until half an hour later when you start questioning all your life decisions. Now that you know fast food secrets about fast food restaurants that you probably didn't know, here is what you should know about salads from fast food restaurants. Number one, salads. Salads are not always the best option. Most people who are on a diet will resort to a salad at a fast food chain, but some salads can be more calorically dense than the biggest burgers. This is because salads are usually loaded up with excess amounts of dressing and hidden ingredients that consumers may not be aware of. Another reason the salads from fast food chains are not the best option is because the meat that is offered is generally deep fried or drenched in some sort of dressing that is calorically dense. Furthermore, the croutons and salad dressing only make it more unhealthy. Cut out the dressing and deep fried meats and you'll have a healthier option. What are some secrets that you know about fast food that weren't in this video? Are you surprised by some of the secrets you didn't know? Let us know in the comment section below. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait, what kind of Bestie would we be if we didn't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video and enjoy.